No, I, I think, I think Dirty Heads is a far superior band. Are, are you serious? Revolution is so much better. No, no, no. It, Dirty Heads has that, has that simplicity of style and lyrics, but I think there's a deeper understated meaning. I think it's almost like Hemingway's iceberg theory, you know? That's such a bull. No, it, it really is true. What does uh, Revolution well, have? Well, have you, ever, have you ever realized how blatantly repetitive Revolution is? Yes. Yeah, well, I think it, it echoes Samuel Beckett's Waiting for Godot, in that it's a social commentary on the monotony of life. <laughs> Do you read Spark Notes for that one? Like you did all year for Babcock? Yeah, right, dude. I got a better grade in that class than you, I'm pretty sure. Whatever, I wasn't a loser through high school. Are you... is that... are you serious? You've always been the bigger loser. Always have, always will. Whatever, I can think of plenty of times where you're the bigger loser than I am. Really? Well, I'd like to hear those. Really? Yeah. Then let's go. Alright. <laughs> I remember you in freshman year Hanging out in the quad, repping Judas Priest gear Long-haired hippie looking classic rock freak Trying to grow a little stubble on your peach fuzz cheeks Well what about when you forgot to be close Standing there looking like a douche in your earth tone And when you had to run a full lap mile There was every expression on your face but a smile, yeah Nah, nah, you shouldn't bring a P.E. man You're the one whose shorts fell off in the pool and Popped up looking like a saw ghost Then your shorts bubble up, man, you're no one to boast Whatever, bro, I can't remember you plan to cheat on the gas station run in the late summer heat. Pulled a scooter out of a bush cause you're lazy. Drew and Dyke popped out and caught you. Baby! Baby, it's high school. It's a real loser here. Maybe it's this sick ass town and this school that always brought us to tears. It could be the people who just drove us nuts. It could be the world. Man, I still think you're the bigger loser. What? Well, there was that time you went in the wrong class. I was really starting to look like a dumbass. Thinking the day was odd when it was even looking round. All confused, standing up and leaving. You really shouldn't talk because it wasn't me. His mom drove me to school their day in the backseat. It's pretty funny watching you step out the car. Lunch bag, 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 school books under your arm. Remember that night we drove down to Ivy? Yeah, it wasn't spring break for UCSB. I'm glad we didn't waste money on a ticket stub. What was that band called? Oh yeah, it was Pete. Oh, dude! Ow. What happened? Oh, Who put a skateboard God. there? Ow. Dude, turn that off, turn it off. Oh. Is your ankle okay? Dude, God. Here. Uh. Oh. dude you're gonna oh. be out of here. Just get up. Right. Oh my God. Alright. I'm good. I'm good. Alright. Alright, All right. just turn that off. Oh God! <laughs> no. Almost ready to go, dude? No, I'm not almost f***ing ready to go. I just broke both my ankles in a series of freak skateboard accidents. I think I'm I think I'm, we're, uh, I'm, What were we I'm talking okay. about? We got it. All right. All right. Ready? The time and wreck that's the thing it really has to be the best when he asks you for an example of a simile. Look back in fear, trying to kill some time, and then turn back around and said his eyes were like diamonds. Maybe it's high school. It's a real loser here. Maybe it's this sick ass town and the school that always poured us to tears. It could be the people who just drove us nuts. It could be the world. Maybe it's us. Whoa, yeah. How about the time you came to school thinking you looked fly, you stepped out the car and you waved as your friend does by the look on his face, let you know that something's wrong, sure enough he has the same motherfucking outfit on. That's true, but I won't forget how you tried so hard to do what Scott wouldn't allow. Every lunch you hopped in the trunk and left, but everybody knows he doesn't G-A-F. But I remember the time you tried to throw that party, the turnout was none and you weren't even there hardly. What you mean, man? There was so much beer, yo. I don't remember much, but I'm no Hemingway hero. You're 
you're such a loser, bench press fail in the school gym Stepped up to the weight bench, outfit fits a win Shouted no spot, I sat down and adjusted The bar fell like a rock, then your neck got all busted Maybe it's high school, it's a real loser here Maybe it's this sick ass down in the school that always brought us to tears Could be the people who just drove us nuts Could be the world Maybe it's us Shut up! Shut up! You guys are both losers. Oh, four! Maybe T. Jones is the loser. Unfortunately, no T. Joneses were hurt in the production of this film. And Scott, we love you, and you do GAF. Any use of alcohol was purely fictional and intended only for laughs and or literary references. And if anybody was offended by this film, don't be, because we simply sought to poke fun at ourselves and others, all in the name of humor. Because that's what we do.
time, baby. 